Before we move on to the, to the more difficult Nishio type paths, let's look at when they open the bag, because it's really common when they open the bag. Um, and when they open the bag, they're creating space. Remember, defensively, I want to create some space. I want to create, I want to create it, and I want to be able to fill that space back up. I would say this is hard to say. You know, I heard me say that before we finish. But I want to slip and slide on this thing and, and make six inches and take six inches. I want to make one inch or half inch. I want to create space defensively. Offensively, at, I'm already in control, and I want to just methodically go through and control and not let a lot of space happen. If space happens, I have to find the neutral because it's neutral. But if you create it, you're ahead of the game. And that's a huge thing. If you create the space, you're ahead of the game. You've dictated it. You've opened the door. Now you know when it happens, and you can take advantage of it. Right? And a good example of that is when you shoot your hips back. When you shoot your hips back, I got to take that space back. You know, we were in this kind of position. And so I'm going to take that space back with my knee, with my foot, block your hip. So you can't come back in on me. If I don't come, if I don't block you, you're going to come back at me. You created it, now you're going to take it back. Okay? So I block it, and now I can come up and take advantage of it with pressure on me and your belly, and then progress, which could not possibly happen. Um, but when they open the back here, the chain things a little bit, the he opens his back. It's hard for me to come around that side, right? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the same type of hold, I'm gonna hold the hip, I'm still gonna do this abstraction, but now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna roll his foot to the ground. I'm just gonna come to the back. I've already checked the front, and I just wanna sit on the ground. Now, what do I need to do to think about it? Anyone, anyway, throw it out. Switch your hips. What's that? Switch your hips. I do wanna switch my hips, but there's, what do I have to do first? If I just switch my hips, He's gonna catch me. Okay. You wanna get behind him? In there, I love this position. Mm. He's gonna reverse back into me potentially. Yeah, you wanna get block him down. Block track, him out. Okay. So I'm here. I put his feet on the ground, very simple. I, the I hit the ground. That's it. This hand goes right there. Because now I block his feet. I've, I've, I've taken the traps away, and now he's gonna move away from his feet. Okay. And bring that pressure in. So he opens. I still do this. And this, do that again. This is, I'm going low to the ankle and I'm pushing my leg straight, lifting the foot and trapping. Now I roll his foot to the back. I'm under one, he's under mine. Now I have to go under his. Just touch the mat. Drive my weight in. And move away from it. 